Hey, we back. We live. What up? Yo. How y'all guys feeling? All right. I'm doing good. Fancy. I'm good this morning. Cold I'm drinking mini man juice out of a Starbucks cup. True, true, true. This right. time I got my shirt on for the, uh, you know, one time for the appropriate shirt. You had me last episode, but this time I got it. Oh. My boy is here, and we hear about that I'm him moments. Mm. And whew. I don't know if Saitama has an I'm him moment. I'm just going to jump right into it. And here's why. The way he's written, he's supposed to be the most overpowered thing. So there's no I'm him because you've always been him. So it's kind of like... Who you showing up to? I'm him moments are for niggas that we thought, like, wasn't him. Nah, nah, nah. And I'm going to disagree with you on that. Because Levi had an I'm him moment. And from the moment you are introduced to Levi, no, no, you no. knew fair, that he was him. His opponent, fundamentally, Levi's I'm him moment was against an opponent he was not supposed to be. Not supposed to. That man shouldn't have even stepped on the battlefield. He, he should have. Levi should have never existed before. against that man. Him. That man literally ran a murder train just to get to the final boss. Like, and then beat the boss. And then, and, and then mind you, beat the boss. This is while he slaughtered like 150 fucking people. Yeah. Oh, no. Levi was First on some music. You can, you Levi was. You was can't that guy. That Levi isn't a Dark Souls character. Like, just the so, Dark Souls main character. Before we jump so, into the episode, it's how not the same. Levi and Satama had the same moment. What would your definition of an I'm him moment be? Like, oh, I just gave you mine. The I'm him moment is a char- character A, I'm him, goes up against someone he's not supposed to beat and absolutely dominates not makes it a fight where it's almost no no dominates and says see i would i would i would disagree with that and i think there's one that you'll agree with me on where that there's a very large exception to that rule for me however um an i'm him moment is like that that coming out party for whatever power or skill or whatever is Everything has culminated to this moment, and it's your time to shine. And you mean you Ichigo with the final uh, Getsu Got Tensho, or I'm, yeah, I'm talking like um, yeah, but he dominated like, Eisen in that fight. Oh I was no, say, like, Pull the on. Final... once he got that, it was a wrap. <laughs> yeah, he dominated Eisen in that fight, right? I think I am. I'm him moments. I would say this. I'm him moments have to be a dominating fight. One, I would side. disagree because there's a fight that you and I agree on fundamentally as one of the greatest fights in all of, of all of anime, Rock Lee versus Gara. So the does it have to be a dominating the, fight or a dominating but, moment? But Rock Lee, a moment what? And a you point, cannot tell me that Rock Lee. That was not Rock Lee. I'm him moment. moment. No, no, no. Really, you wouldn't count that. No, not when he Rock pulls Lee. the weights off and the just weights? starts that's, no, 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 no. Gara his that is that is a I'm fast moment. Or I thought, you know, like you thought I was this, but I'm not. But that was not a I'm him because he lost drastically to Gar. Like, he, to no, no, he, he lost barely to Gar. He, he lost barely to Gar. He lost. If Gar did cannot not lose a I'm him moment, I think can't. I think you can because I think I, I'm him. Just like his fight on against, the level. Kimmy because, Morrow, he lost in his fight when we, when we, no, no, no. They technically won that fight. Moment, and his drunken fist. But then you lose to Kimi Maru and have to be saved by Gar. Like they they keep hot. That's plot I garbage. Will say That's that plot they, garbage. Naruto did lead dirty. Naruto did lead dirty, and I will not hear anything. That's what I will say. They kept hoeing Nar- uh, Lee they across did. the board the entire time because and he does no not. Reason. Open but that's what I'm saying, though. It's like even then, much. there's still an argument to be made that that Lee on his best day can murk. So many of those guys, and I think that our first taste of that was that fight where he goes, oh, but you thought you I'm weak because I can't use can't ninjutsu again. I will say this. Let me show you the power Rock of these Lee, hands. Our him moment was when he beat Sasuke in the, prelim- like, not in the preliminaries, but when Sasuke was trying to start a fight before the preliminaries, and Rock Lee was like, hey, you're not even nowhere near Neji's level. Chill out, bro. I'm about to beat your ass real quick. See, I don't even, but see, here's my issue with that is Sasuke's, for me, Sasuke's stock as a fighter had fallen so much 
because he also just kept getting whooped. Yeah, Sasuke was getting whooped. Like a lot he, in those he early lost days. to Haku. Yep. He lost to Lee. Yep. He got whooped in the forest yep. by all the sound dudes. And then he got clapped by Orochimaru. Yep. Like he lost every fight leading up to that. Anytime. So I don't think I don't think Lee's I'm him win. moment comes in Sasuke. Because at this point, Sasuke's an NPC with a cool name. Mm-hmm. Hey. You can't have an I'm him moment and lose the fight because you're not him. I, you I know, another cartoon like me, they enter the character in the I'm him moment and they lose the fight. So, but you're telling me that Lee beat Lee almost beating Gara, like getting this close, even though he's not supposed to be in the fight and still standing up going, Come get this work. That doesn't. What about just, when Aang? He went was into the uh, avatar mode, right? Aang's I'm him moment was when he was no, getting ready about- to legit wipe the floor with every sandbender that was standing there. And the only thing that saved them niggas was his love for Qatar. That's it. Because Aang was getting ready to say, I don't give a fuck about being a monk. I don't give a fuck about being the avatar. I don't give a fuck about none of that. I will kill all of you right here, right fucking now. I'm not and he was that. to. He wanted his bison. Y'all niggas kidnapped something that belonged to me. I was trying to help the world and not belong said, to him. You no, no, I, Appa you, did not belong to Appa. If I believe if Aang wanted Appa like, was his he, best friend, his soul, like yeah, like that that's, a, that's a non-lover soulmate type. And thing. for you to kidnap him? Nah, they were trapped in that iceberg for a hundred years together. Like yeah. no, that's Appa, what I'm saying. Appa, everything Appa else Appa was, was my boy. Friend. Yeah, and I and I feel that. But that was that's that's Aang's I'm him moment outside of uh maybe when he fought the fire lord but it was so it was so like obvious that i don't count that as a i'm him moment when he goes back to but that's that no, no, no. but what about when he get, went into the avatar state he was about to go berserk and then boom azula claps his ass that wasn't an i'm him moment for me because i feel like every time he stepped into that avatar I, state i don't know man was, I, I, I'm, him. Aang's, Aang's, I'm him moments because it's odd for me right it's odd because he's an airbender and because a hundred years have went by without anyone really fighting against an airbender, it just kind of like makes it odd and awkward, right? So they don't really know how to fight Aang. Not to mention, Aang was not an offensive person. Aang was a very defensive fighter. He did not want to fight. It just looked like he was offensive because he could wipe the floor with a bunch of people. But it's because he had an advantage that they that they didn't. Aang seen firebenders. He's watched Firebenders fight. He's watched Earthbenders. He's seen all of this. They hadn't seen Airbenders fight. They had no idea what the fuck to do. Azula did. No, Azula, Azula, Azula was baffled trying to fight Aang. She was just very, yeah, very yeah, strong. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. fighting Aang one-on-one, Azula was baffled as fuck. She was like, yeah. I have no idea how to pin him down. I can't uh, yeah. pin him down. This so, man is literally a wet noodle. While it was like, harder to pin him down, <laughs> Azula like, I had his number. <laughs> It was she. She struggled, which is why she went to go get three other people. Azula couldn't get yeah. hanged by herself. Yeah, right, she knew we, that. We way off topic. Next, uh, next, I'm him moment. What you got, Ty? So I was thinking. Um, I don't know if y'all watched Mob Psycho 100. I've yeah. Heard. Yeah. So the so you watch season two. Yeah. That final fight against the dad, where Mob is like, "No, this is my power. Bow down to me." Yo. Yeah. Where you yeah, thought yeah. Mob could stop at 100, and he Dude. was like, Oh, Yo. you yeah. gone. Because you I gone. gone. But Fuck my power yeah. start. Yeah. We yeah, out he here, bro. Peeling, he, he peels reality apart just to beat this man. Imagine pissing someone off so badly they rip the fabric of space and time apart just to beat your ass. They yeah. make time stop just to whoop you. Mm hmm. That, yeah, and then he just and then he just comes down and it's just bull cut. <laughs> it, it reminds me of the Gojo fight against the volcano dude. Yeah, see that was another one. Or yeah. the or against the black guy. He, he was like, like Oh, you mean when he just boxed yeah, his shit man? I need you for no reason. And, and it's like Gojo's like, I don't know why you motherfuckers keep coming for me. Like I'm not <laughs> I'm that not him. Like, Yo, how I'm he, him? If, if I'm the one getting embarrassed like that, I know someone's recording it. I'm out, dog. That's that's it for me. Y'all done seen the last. I mean, I'm sitting there thinking about okay, wait. Now we done sent three people after this man, right? And and they done, none of them have ever came back. So why the fuck would I go? 
Like right. I'm not understanding. Yeah. That's yeah, like I don't, if you see a nigga cross the line. I don't see why me else. going to die is a good idea here. Yeah, like, why no. don't you? I magically am just able to beat him now. No. I'm the one. It's gonna be me. Like after the other guys like, all had higher score. power levels than me. After you, you had me the this. flyer saying this guy is the strongest one of all of them, so you're gonna go fight him. No. Like, I'm not gonna be like, listen, dog, we power measure him, but I know I'm not stronger than you. And if you ain't going to go fight him, why would I go fight him? I'm not going to go fight him. I'm crazy. I'm not stupid. I never understood that for villains in general, right? Why wait so long? If you know you're so overpowered, why wait so long? Or send other little minions to go do shit? It's, it's like and it kind of reminds me of, like, Power Rangers, right? Like, Rita Rita. Repulsa at the why, why didn't you just go do it? Like, yeah. why did you put all that, of these like, little monsters, let the Power Rangers figure out who they were going to be, and then go first. You allow them to like them. grow further in strength and get more stuff. So yeah, like when they start off and they're like, thing. "Oh, it's, we're it's, looking it's, for the Zords. We're looking for this." You yeah. let them build up their collection of Zords. Yeah. Like, it was the same. It was Eisen did the same thing. Like Eisen, why didn't you just kill these people? I don't understand why you had this whole elaborate plan. Once you got the Hogioku, you should have just murked everybody. Eisen didn't need it. Everyone else, they've already said everyone in the Soul Society had been under Aizen's spell the entire fucking time. They had all seen his Zambato. The only one that didn't was Ichigo. You could have killed Ichigo yourself a long fucking time ago. And you could have murked him the second he got in there. You could have had Tosin kill him. You could have had Jen kill him. You could have no, done We that. don't have other people you do our had Fire Granddad kill him for Christ's you sake. Could have had, you could have killed Ichigo at any given time. His dad was already bound, so he couldn't hit. He didn't have access to his Bankai or nope. even access to uh, his Geek uh, uh, Geekai yet. Spoiler alert. Giving out spoilers about uh, Ichigo's dad. Some no. people have not. This is not a spoiler. Right. Ichigo, right. this shit happens before he, he fights Aizen. He came back in the last fight and against Aizen. You, you're right. My bad. Yeah, what the fuck you talking about? This shit ain't spoiled. If you ain't seen the original Bleach by now, nigga. Oh, nah, then you fucked up. If you he never, it came back. Uh, it had time to come back. And um, Kisuke wasn't getting, like, Kisuke was literally not getting involved in shit. No. So, he really he, was like, Eisen. So, again, not why did he wait so long? Because final bad guy, obviously. <laughs> Eisen wasn't even the final bad guy. You know who didn't wait that long? Yulabak. And you know what happened when that nigga showed up? He killed everybody. Yeah, nah, he did not play around. He didn't mess around. He, with games. he said you actually. He said you have three days, and that's because I can't stay out of the shadow longer than three days. If I yeah. could, this should be a wrap. Like, and he sent his minions, and then when he could appear himself, oh, that nigga. Oh yeah, only because he wanted Eisen. He he wanted to like checkmate. Like, all right, let me get Eisen on board. Let's checkmate this shit just so we know. But he wasn't worried was about Yamamoto. He wasn't worried about Ichigo. He wasn't worried about none of the motherfuckers. He was going to kill them all. His only concern was the Zero Squad. Who, I'm going to say right now, I'm pissed off, doesn't have an I'm him moment. None of them. But you know who did have an I'm him moment? The captain of the motherfucking Soul Society. Like, he won that fight. He got hold. Yeah. When he when he lit he the fucking sky on fire, dog, he burned and brought back the enemies of the dead to fight against him. That is, I don't know if that's I'm him. You can't lose an I'm him moment. He I didn't do. lose to. He didn't lose. He lost. To oh, he lost. No, he not only did you lose, are you, about? you lost to a copy nigga. You didn't even lose to the real you about. You he lost, lost to the real nigga. He, he beat the copy nigga, and then you about pulled up and then stabbed him and said, you thought you had me. So again, you wasted all of your energy and time on a copy nigga. You didn't even know. You to know. You're, you're the head captain. You should know if you're fighting a copy nigga. He's done this twice now. No, nah, you're right. You're he right. did it against Isaac. <laughs> he uh, fucked up against the little waste kid, little fucking thing that sucked up all his fire. So now he's useless against Isaac. And now, now, you still don't understand that that's not you, a Bach motherfucker? Hey, so no, then, hey, Captain I doesn't have an I'm him moment. He's powerful as fuck. Not I am. Does Vegeta have an I'm him moment? Because yes. I ain't never seen nobody eat more L's than Vegeta. No, Vegeta had an I'm him moment against Android. Are you Knight kidding me? When he point blanks, uh, what was his name? Uh, that was it. It's the only time he killed No, that was, that was just like the first one. 
No, Vegeta's I'm Him moment was against Android 19. He destroyed Android 19. Yeah, and he, he, like, no he, idea. he did, It wasn't even close against 18. Like, you just, he shows up, he's like, nah, Kakarot, sit the fuck down. And then he that was 18. Just I'm him moment. pulls out 19. Yeah. Just hold him out. He By watched, way, he watched he Kakarot did. just get his ass beat left and right. And he's like, all right, like, I'm sick of this shit. Y'all move. Yeah, it absolutely yeah. destroys nineteen. Yeah, that was pretty. He there was absolutely not even, destroyed nineteen. Yeah, um, that was, cell that was second form. That was Vegeta said. I will Vegeta mop cell second. Form. Yeah, he did almost mop. as bad as Gohan did. But now cell's final form. You would argue, well, okay, Vegeta, holy shit, why'd you let that happen? But doesn't matter. Yeah, it's not nice. Vegeta's had. I'm yeah, him. Yeah. He's had it. He's had his spare share. Nah. He's had his had had final uh, form. Gohan had his. I'm him moment. Like, Gohan had one, yeah. When Gohan pulled up in Super Saiyan 2, I'm him. Nigga, I'm a winner. Yeah, but his arrogance overshadowed and it, it, it overshadowed so much that it would, I don't think it allowed the full I'm him on. Because it wasn't. I, I would still give it to him because he still it wasn't does. Toying in the sense of like, I'm going to keep beating your ass toying. It was legit toying like, I punched you. Okay, now I'm just going to wait on you to do something because. He's a child. I know. You got to remember, like. It wasn't It wasn't about him being a child. Every arrogance happened like that to a Super Saiyan. The yeah, overconfidence and arrogance came with it. Now, Goku is an adult. adult. Goku has less arrogance, though. Like, who? Go Goku's. Gohan oh, wasn't this arrogant. He legit beat the fuck out of Frieza and no, turned not Goku. Out. Gohan has less arrogance as an adult going Super Saiyan than go than the rest of the. Oh, by that, by yeah, that time, Gohan is also a house dad. <laughs> yeah, hey, by that you time, also a house dad. You can't talk Gohan shit. Added into that. I, you know, am I out here going Super Saiyan? <laughs> no. All right, cool. <laughs> you always know there's some dumbass debate. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You don't have that arrogance, nigga. We're not <laughs> saying. I'm not a saying. I'm not a saying. <laughs> I've tried to hit a Kamehameha once or twice. It ain't happened. <laughs> I've tried to fly once or twice. Both of them were bad ideas. <laughs> that ain't happened either. <laughs> Both of them were bad ideas. I jumped really high. Came down Yo. really hard. Yo, you know what? You know what? One of my favorite I'm him moments is just reminding me because just trying to do some shit you couldn't do and then just being able to do it. Yo, when Karapika showed up with a shovel. Oh, yeah. Oh. To fight that spider dude. Yeah. So Yo. You know what that shit was so disrespectful. <laughs> Yo, I was absolutely I'm him. I think that's probably one of the most like disrespectful fights. Yo, across the that shit, and he's just like, you never stood a chance. Why did you show up? I brought the shovel. The, yeah, like I, I <laughs> prematurely brought a shovel knowing <laughs> that you were not gonna win this fight. I'm saying no. if anybody ever shows up to a fight with me and they bring a shovel, dog. Never mind, you got it. I, whatever we was beefing about, it wasn't that important. I promise it you. Wasn't. It, it, it wasn't. It never was. Do you ever remember? Did you ever see Tokyo Ghoul? I only watched the first season. So the in fight, the in fight was his best. I'm him moment. I would give that to him. Oh, after he when after he, he fucking snaps and he kills. Yeah, him, boy. when he had to kill yeah. Jason when he pulled that earworm out and he was like, Nah, bro. Yeah, I've had enough of this shit. I'm gonna let yeah. you know who I am. Like. You thought you were going to take me out, and now I'm going to eat you. That was, you know, I don't know, but in in um in Soul Eater, mm -hmm. when uh the uh, the head guy is fighting, oh uh, death is yeah. fighting with yeah. um yeah yeah, and, and you're like, no, oh, death isn't just this goofy fuck. No, 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 no. no. Death, death, death is like. Death will fuck you. <laughs> He's like, his goofy voice is just for the yeah. kids. All yeah. of this stuff is for this the kids. This is our charade. I will kill These all of you. These hands are the real reason why yeah. I get to leave. And that was, a, that, was a, that was, a, I can't remember the, the villain's name, but that was his issue. Was like, you've created this goofy ass, I'm for the kids look. When I know your nickname, Death, ain't just a fuck. It ain't, ain't there just to be cool, nigga. Yeah. Like, you were given that name for a reason. Yeah. Because you would legit just kill shit. Just kill. Now, on the flip side, how have you ever realized a moment where they went from being that guy to no longer being even relevant? So here's an example, and we'll just throw out the obvious. Yamamoto, right? From the original 13 squads, he was a slayer. And then coming to nowadays, Yamamoto... He's barely like his thirst, his blood thirst is almost gone. I've got one. Well, I would say the same thing about Unahana then. 
because so, everyone on, on. I got, I got, got one I got one show. like she was she was that that woman and I'm not gonna hold you when she got to it with Kimpachi and she beat his ass and killed him just to bring him back that was badass but she herself admitted I I still ain't got it like I used to after crossing bleeds with you I think she purposely let that nigga win nah I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give you one that's not, not a fight I'm gonna okay. give you a moment that's not a fight the the end of death note when light walks in against against n or m whichever brother it was uh it was m so he walks in against m and he walks in and he's like i'm god i have this whole thing I'm and Kira, ju- I'm a- th- he just gets picked apart dog and he just knew that the other cop was gonna have his back and he's like yep. why aren't you following me like i thought you believed in Kira. And he's like nah bro like you crazy like I don't, I don't know what this is. I don't know what you thought was gonna happen, but I'm a cop. Like your dad went down trying to save you. Mm. Mm-hmm. I didn't really watch Death Note. Nah, Death Note is definitely worth the watch. It's really, it's definitely like 2000. So season anime. one was great. Season was two was like season, season one of one Death Note. Gas. Season two it falls short of season one. Yeah, I it's, won't say it's, bad, it's not as good not compared as good. to season one. Yeah, like it's comparing not as good. it to season, season one, one you're like really fucking good. Uh, who else? Um, oh, obviously, um, uh, JDF or the Green Ranger, not as the White Ranger. The oh, Green Ranger Green has had Green, a Green thousand. Green became my favorite color after that. <laughs> a thousand on him moments. But the biggest being, one has to be. Being, how old is JDF? Like, I mean, not how old? How tall? Like. Six feet, let's just give it even six feet, right? And then you jump all the way up to a fucking 95 foot Zord, go inside the cockpit, and just start handing out L's to everybody. It's 5v1, and I right. beat all the ass. In a barber it's chair, faded all the asses. I looked it up. He it's beat five, them I, out of their Ranger floor. Man went from being 5'10 to jumping 95 feet in the air and throwing niggas out of their shit. Like fucking Grand Theft Auto style. He beat you out of your Zor in your Ranger form. He terrorized you. That Just for that nigga to go back to your high school and be like... No, no, no. Now do something about it. For him to take over the Red Ranger's team and steal his girlfriend. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, no, no. I, I, don't, think, I don't think they were ever near... They were never mutually exclusive. But she went from, oh, I don't, mean, think, she, I don't think that he was, he would ever even classify her as his girl. I don't think they were ever, they were, but they, they look like they had something. They look like they I had something. I think the Tommy that. jumped in. I think my really? putting that shit together. All right. Here's a, here's a question for y'all. Who, who, anime or whatever, who are you waiting for to have an I'm him moment? Oh. Like, what's a character that oh. you, are watching right now that you're just waiting on to just kind of have that moment where you're like, oh, okay, yeah, it, it's anime, but that's because I watch a lot of fucking anime, so it doesn't. Uh, as do I. Now, mind you, he's already had an I'm him moment, but not at the same level. So Asta, Asta's already mm-hmm. had an I'm him moment. I need but him not to at the same him level him. as you know. You know has gotten like panels of pages. Oh. Of one the newest one of, issue of what he did in the like last week. I That's want Asta's. Him. I pray that Asta's fight. Okay, I'm trying not to spoil it. I'm trying to Asta's fight it. against the final big bad guy. Against the final big, big baddie is a one v one. It has to be. It goes. I'm him. I don't care who's here. We're going to fight. Period. I don't want a 2v1 like they did against the devil and then have to be saved by the fucking first Wizard King and then lit. No, I want Asta's, I'm him. I'm the strongest nigga around. No one's weak. Like, I deserve I'm him. We fight. It's either I win or we all lose. Yeah. So for me, I want Luffy to have that moment. As a One Piece fan, I watch One Piece for the adventure and it's not necessarily the place. Let's go ahead and mute his mic real quick. <laughs> the moment, the moment. You asked. You asked. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. So All right, me, I have to hate on one piece. It's required. Eh, whatever. <laughs> Luffy loses a lot more fights. Like, so he'll get into the fight and it'd be like, all right, dog, we going back and forth. 
and you might take a, this round, I take this round, I do this, I do that. Mm-hmm. I need him to have a defining, <sighs> this is why I deserve to be the Pirate King type of moment. Like the moment we can all point to as fans and be like, this is why we watch One Piece. Right. Not right. There's so many characters that have that. Zoro's getting his coming up in the anime, probably in like the next two episodes. Luffy's about to do some cool shit, but like he just doesn't have that I'm him moment to be like, yeah, this is what he did. The niggas right. teamed up with Goku. The niggas been on the cover of Naruto. He By the way, I think that's going to be the only episode of One Piece I'll ever actually watch is the random crossover episode. They did two. They did yeah. two? Oh, damn it. Now I have to watch two episodes of One Piece. So they, they crossed over with Toriko and, uh, and Dragon Ball Z Dragon because Ball Z. they're yeah. all made by Toei. Yeah. So uh, yeah, I saw that. I was like, that's. Oh, cool. did you guys hear? Side note, did you guys hear that Toriyama's not making any more manga? He's not well, drawing or illustrating any more manga. So not even the offshoots and the one shots. Nah, he says, I am done drawing. I'm not making any more manga illustrations. Damn. That's Since we're talking about people that's going out. Well, most likely. I old. mean, first off, the nigga's old. Let's just yeah. point that out. And then to be fair, Dragon Ball Z is a $17 billion like industry. Dragon, yeah. And when I say Dragon Ball Z, I mean like Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z. The DT, games. The super. Everything. Games, manga, the whole shebang. Theme parts. Seventeen billion dollars. If I'm a billionaire, bro, I'm kind of done writing too. I'm just gonna hire somebody else to do this shit. I'm not gonna hold you down. Pray, I'll get a younger illustrator, someone that's young in the game, and pray that their art starts to match the upcoming art that's out. So Beach's artwork, um, um. He inspired so many people that they they have to be copycats everywhere, lining up to show him like what I want to be like you. Like Toriyama's been one of those dudes in the game. I don't know, man. It depends on the industry, bro, because the the industry might not for manga, right? Because we're not talking about animation. For animation, it's different. If you're talking about mangas, the the, the industry might not just be there anymore. Where I want to draw because the world is moving into animation. Yeah, but, you, but, yeah, without, but, without the, but 90 but ninety five percent of all anime comes from manga and light novels. So you're well, never well, yeah, 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 yeah. I get that. So, but so you I can do a light movie. novel. I can write a light novel and then have it made into an animation. Like but not all light but novels but get the, made in the anime. Yeah, most like most manga is or most anime is manga first and then and then the smaller light novel things, those are basically your isekai. So mm-hmm. your 10,000 isekai that are coming out are all just light novels. So if right. you want isekai to stop, or at least cut down a lot, please, for the love of God, Japan. Not if you start down. going the route of Netflix. Netflix started no, making- I think Netflix, Netflix made working. animations. They were making yeah, Netflix animations. Yeah, Netflix out of it. No, making those no manga. I dislike the Netflix animation style a lot. So you don't like Book of Ragnarok? I, I did. It's not that I didn't like the story. Um, the fights were very cool. I don't like the animation style. I don't like the art style. Mm. So is it like, like uh, I didn't like it for um, uh, what was the other big? They was it Castlevania? I don't. No, I like Castlevania. Like I'm not gonna hold you like down. It. I don't know. Castlevania was about awesome. it. Something I about like it feels cheap. Um, Something about it. Feels I don't know if the book came out first, but like, um, the Castlevania also came from a game though, so that's different. No, I know, but I'm saying, but they, they are taking properties and turning them into into anime, like animations, without without um without the use of mangas or illustrations prior to. Right, and it's and it it doesn't look good. I don't think it looks good. You know, or like I Invisible. Do I don't know if Invisible was a comic before it yeah, came. Yes. It, it, yeah, it was series. like that. Like um, I've had, an, like I have an invincible comic from like when Marks a. I just hate how the show doesn't follow the comic, so to speak. Okay, let me More let me ask less. you guys this. So you y'all have watched or looked at enough manga and comics and stuff. What do you think is an artist like? Can you think of artists off the top of your head that have had I'm him moments where you're just like everything you're looking at and everything you're reading is just so insane and just goes off so well like the way you're reading it the illustrator of 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 invisible 
Omni Man okay. for some reason was everything I wanted. Like, and call oh, me villain. Yeah, 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 yeah. Invisible. Call me, call me, call me evil. I don't give a fuck. He was what yeah. I wanted Superman to be. The nigga that says I'm him. It don't matter who you are. The ass whooping he gave his own son is out of this world. I want to give my son that same ass whooping, but it, it'd be right. murder. And so, therefore, I can't. And <laughs> people frown upon that. They frown. Yeah, like, why, they frown, they frown upon knowing that you want to give him that same ass whooping. See, oh, I'm, no. I'm, with, I'm with Mac. I'd, I'd feed my kids that ass whooping too. The ass whooping that he gave his son sets a clear precedent. I'm him, and it don't matter who you think you are. I'm that nigga. You can you can save this pilot as much as you want. The moment you catch and save him, I'm going to kill him. Boom. Dead. You know when that? he smashed his son's face through the train and killed those people, that was too much for me. I don't no, know. No, that's, 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 that's an I'm him. That was an I'm him moment. That was, that, was, that, was, that, was that man, that man he literally showed him. I'm he going said, to look. kill people to beat your ass. I know, yeah. I'm willing to kill people to beat into you that one, this is who we are as Vildramites. This is what we fucking do. And for you to have sympathy amongst these low life fucking people is very aggravating. Like their lifespans are like this to us. These, these people are ants. They but you're asking me matter. to stop feeling for my mom, my friends, my family when I- He didn't say stop feeling for her. He said, think of her more as your pet. <laughs> I was you, just gonna say a bird, and I'm, I'm not gonna hold you to that. <laughs> that she's more like I love my mama, but if my daddy looked at me and said, "Look at her as a dog," I'm gonna treat this nigga like he fucking crazy. Like, hey, but yeah, but if I can fly, if your dad said you can't, 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 can't treat me like I'm crazy because I'll beat your ass, and there's nothing you can do about it, right? Also, also, I'm strong enough to punch my way to the core of the earth if I want to. She is now an ant. Like I've lived, like, I've lived by and large, I love you. her too hard. She dies anyway. Yeah, because I've lived for thousands of years. Yeah. Like, yeah, I take too long on the toilet. She died of, of old age. Mentality against a seventeen-year-old who's going through puberty. Like you got to remember. But no, that's, that's, that's how he's seventeen. Do. They were born and bred that way. They destroy yeah. shit at yeah, seventeen. He's not human, so it doesn't which is matter. why he was aggravated that he kept yeah. feeling that way. And then, of course, he, again, he said, what 17 years? Live this long, what 17 more years? Yeah, I can long. make another one. I can make another one. What 17 more? That's I'm him if there's nothing yeah. else that says I'm that's, him. That's so like, like the only reason I'm still breathing is because he felt he didn't feel it was necessary to waste the energy to kill me. No, nah, I think he really felt like worth- this is my son. I'm, I'm really pr- I'm proud of him. But I need to leave this place because if not, I'm going to grow soft. And in my in my world, they kill soft people. Yeah. So For me, it was. wasn't that. It was, and I'm not a Batman fan. So like, y'all gonna have to forgive me for this one. But it was Batman when he came up with all the Justice League plans on how to take them out. And someone came like, it was like Vandal Savage or like Lex Luthor. Whatever the fucking villain was that took all his plans Vandal and was Savage. like, I'm, yeah. very familiar I'm going to use that shit on them myself that's batman's i'm him because like having a backup plan for everyone including yourself nigga i'm him i don't know no, 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 no. i don't think that's i'm him i think that's preparation if you give anybody yeah. fucking preparation that's i don't know that's what Batman being able to like beat dark side though like beat dark side as in i'm willing to gamble that you won't blow everything up no, no, no. He put on a suit and went no, no. Dark Side's ass. No, no, he's, he's, no. He's no. He's he's fought Dark Dark Side. Uh, no, no, sorry. To, uh, to he, the he, victory. He's he's done that, but he's also like just gambled, and he was just really good at gambling. No, 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 no. Because I, at a certain point, it's not gambling. It's just having bigger nuts than your enemy, mm-hmm. like. Which is a gamble. Gonna what, what if Dark said what if Dark Side was like, you know what? Nah, fuck this planet. I'll blow yeah, this God. Like, I'm gonna yeah, live. But Batman knows he's not gonna do it. Not. Batman said, do it, pussy, and Dark Side and Dark Side said no. <laughs> me, pussy. <laughs> he said, parry this, you filthy Batman casual. Decided to call you a and then shot him. You a bitch, dog. You ain't gonna do it. <laughs> but now I would say more of his I'm him moment is on the flip side of that. 
when they said, well, what do we do? He said, well, what's your plan to stop you? He was like, y'all. <laughs> Indicating it will take all of you to stop <laughs> me. That, as a, as a human that only has money, that is an item moment. My yeah. power, my power is wealth, and I'm going to stand amongst gods. Like that man's power is wealth. And that is an I'm him moment. Yeah. The, yeah, when you sit at the table with gods and you're the one making them get you your food, yeah, you're so kind of him you're kind of him. But at yeah. some point, we're gonna have to circle back and do the best DC slash Marvel villains. Like those are gonna be two separate arguments, and like we're gonna have to crown a champion. I've already got. I've already got who I think. I want. Oh, it depends. No, 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 no. We have to. We have to. We're, we're we going to have to circle back because it's ain't. It's ain't. It's ain't. What back. we have to do is make that a very small like parameters, right? Because if you say all of comics, it's not fair. Because no, I said DC and Marvel. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot. Of, I'm saying when you talk Yo, about hang on, hang on, hang on. To, to get back on to get back on a topic, right? To get back on a topic, right? So we've talked a lot about like different anime moments, uh, different like scenes. What's what's a like a, a show with like because it's easy to do like animations and drawings and stuff, but what's like a, a live action show that's kind of just made your jaw drop and go, nah, that's he's him. Breaking bad. And I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna show you something. I'm gonna show you I'm him. Alright, I like I'll I would say I don't know how the fuck we got to I'm to break it back, and I have no idea how Dude, the fuck. No, nah, there's some there's some cold blooded moments in that, bro. When he blew him up and Gus's face looked like Yo. this. I'm yeah. him. Yeah. Gus and Gus out just kind of turns. Like, Fix yeah. this tie. You see this side of his face? Yep. Then you see this side? Yeah. And it's, oh, nah, shit. Gus, no. was, Gus was hey. that man. Gus was him. After that, yeah, he's like, well, I just, fuck it. And, dog, that was cold. Yeah. Like, cold. I'm, I'm him. Like, what yeah. are you going to do? And right. he's like, uh, I'll show okay. you. Well, like when he name. first hits the Heisenberg, he's like, now say my name. Say my name. Yeah, oh, and like, just gonna, oh, yeah, and you're just like, oh, shit. You are not like, into, like, Tuco Salamanca of all people. <laughs> Smallville. When the red sun, when 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 Clark gets, um, gets uh, a little taste of red kryptonite and the red sun, and the motherfucker damn near just like he wild wild west is the entire town and turns that bitch into like his city, like that's the I like none of you guys will ever stop me. Like Lex Luthor, I killed him. He's dead. Um, Lois, I locked her ass up in a room somewhere. She can't ever get the fuck out. So you know, it's just me. Like I run this shit. I don't give a fuck who y'all are. I would if we're talking live action. I was I would go Smallville. Smallville. So I. Oh no! I lied. I thought about. Did y'all ever watch The Boys? Yeah. The Boys. Same boat. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, there's so like, like trying to pick any one of um Homelander's moments, like when. No, when he found out that he took his wife. Yeah. And then he was standing there, and he had the son at the end, and I'm yeah. like, Homelander's yeah. like, I'm and he just him. shows up at the house. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or like uh, that's just fucking Arrow. Slade Wilson and Arrow was the biggest I'm him nigga across the board. Like, yo, low key, Death Deathstroke is probably one of the most underrated villains in all of DC. Oh, absolutely. He only doesn't Deathstroke get the respect he deserves because of the Judas contract. Like it just Ju- the Ju- excluding the Judas contract ever being made, we don't talk about it. If we um, left the Judas contract out of everything, Slade is probably one of the best. No, because the thing is, the Judas contract happens normally, but they changed some things. And if you've watched it, you know what I'm talking about. Um, if you haven't, please don't watch it. So I'm, this is the one time I'm going to tell watch you it, not to watch it. It's still an animated at, movie. And that 19, Do not watch that. Whatever, like I want to say, eighty something. Like it was still hinted at back then that that was still the thing. It's oh, it just it I'm got gonna, more. I'm gonna do a deep dive on the Judas contract. I'm gonna figure because that if they had left out that one bit, watch that watch that entire movie. Yo, we should do a side episode for uh, just introspectives on villains. Like I would do that. But I'd be here for it. Yo, you know you know what? Um, I don't know if you guys watch Supernatural. 
Yeah. You ever Fucking watched that? that show? That show. That show, I think, kind of was like my first set of live action I'm him moments. Just being, you know, being, being I'm him. Like, right. there was no you're, more you're that just pull like... off some absolute god tier shit. And then they're just like, and we keep moving on. Mm-hmm. Yo, when Dean got the bleed and then he kills the angel and he's like, you killed my brother. Right. I yeah. have the mark of Cain. I have the demon blade. Oh, bro, you got to die. <laughs> have y'all ever seen, um, fuck, I just had the name too. Fuck. What's it about? Sound it out. Use your words. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> it's 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 Klaus, Nicholas, and Rebecca. They're, 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 oh, the originals. The oh. originals. Klaus's Klaus's I'm him moment when when he walks into the courtyard and there's literally other vampires standing around and they like, nah, we run this town. And Klaus is like, okay, fuck it, like let's all like let's fight. And it's him against like fifty other vampires and he beats all of their asses. Yeah. Just yeah, hands in just like straight courtyard, just like yo, Klaus okay. was that nigga. Klaus had some issues internally, but Klaus always walked in like I'm him. Klaus, all of his siblings recognized, hey, if we don't like the person to not piss off, it's probably Klaus. Don't yeah. piss him off. Bro, like, let's let's off the highway. As happy as possible. Klaus, have you ever seen the originals? No, I haven't. Oh, you should watch oh. it. I'm learning. I'm learning some shit because because this, all, you have this to is watch how I learn if I'm, if I'm in. If I'm trying to get in, don't watch the shit. originals. Don't watch Vampire Diaries. This shit is gay. That's how you get introduced to who Klaus is. You no, don't you can control. just watch all right, the original. All right, all right. I, I've already through through other means. I've had a peripheral uh, viewing of of Vampire Diaries. Don't so. watch that shit. I didn't anyway, watch it on purpose. Klaus so. is the type of nigga where like he will, so you can't kill, he can't kill his siblings or he won't kill his siblings, right? He loves them too much. But that doesn't stop him from putting him into really long slumbers. This nigga's sister was dating somebody that he did not like. Not only did he kill him, but then he stabbed her with like the special made dagger that put her to sleep for like 150 years and just left her ass sleep. And just walked that the girl that like got buried up in the concrete? Oh no, that was in the that was in no, the no, no no no. He he always he always no, kept he's in body. no. I know I know who he is. I've seen him in body. As a matter of fact, he has special made coffins for his, his sister and his brother, so that whenever they pissed him off, he would just stab them and put them to sleep in that coffin. Yeah, they call and it dagger. There. And then they wake up after a while. He'd be like, "Okay, your punishment's over." And they'd be like, "What year is it?" He's like, "It's been 150 years." And they'd be like, "You motherfucker!" <laughs> I'd have slapped the shit out of somebody. Bro, you, you didn't miss me for 100. What happens if you die? He's a they're vampires. They don't die. They don't. So like, you're telling me no? They can get killed by other no, vampires. They were the original vampires. So yeah, they're, they're, they're the original, original vampires. vampires. Can't so die. they make other vampires? But I mean, yeah, you could try to kill them. But are you going to be able to beat Nicholas? No. That's annoying as fuck. Can you beat Klaus? No. <laughs> so what are you and doing? Like trying to figure out where your bloodline came from, or like who mm-hmm. you were made from because you technically have like almost a bloodline allegiance to whoever made you originally. So it'd be like, I the was only, made. There's only one person that they all fear and that's their father. But that's because their father is a, like a famous vampire hunter. So he became a vampire hunter after they became vampires. vampires. And so he is a special vampire. He's the only nigga that makes like Klaus shit himself every time he sees him. Yeah. He couldn't see his dad and be like, like anytime they got within a hundred miles of their dad, they, they have to run it. They couldn't let him get within a hundred miles of them. A continent was not enough <sighs> space to keep him from hunting them now. Like their dad was that dude. Sounds like Speaking he's that just, dude. It um, sounds like he's slow. I'm mad that they like got rid of the Darth Vader, the Star Wars comics. Cause Vader was that dude in the comics. Like he was surrounded by a, a fucking world of people, and he looked at them and told them, "I'm not surrounded by people. I'm surrounded by dead men," and proceeded to murder them all. Yeah, but that's just the jigsaw. I'm not trapped in here with you. You're trapped in here with me. Thing. Vader was that dude, and like that is why Vader will always be my number one. He is my number one Star Wars whatever. 
you ask me who my favorite character in Star Wars is, it's Vader. And there's a very specific reason why. You ready? He's the voice of Mufasa. Enough said. <laughs> you, I think on that note, we're probably we probably exhausted a lot of the uh I'm him moments. I'm him moments. Um yeah, bro. When you start talking about Mufasa, yeah. yeah. I think, I think we're done here. James All, right, y'all. All right, y'all. Let us know what some of y'all favorite I'm him moments, anime, video games, TV shows, whatever you like. Um, put it down in the comments. Uh, let us know. Maybe oh, we'll uh, next time. Before we leave, let's address some of the comments from the last video. Charles said that we left out uh, Kiba. Kiba was not that dude. He said Madara was that guy. We left out Madara in the movie. Oh, we tried not to stay in one universe too long. Yeah, we tried not to. We, we, right. we did a lot of Naruto. So yeah. we skipped over we Naruto. To stay out of the Naruto universe because clearly yeah. we all know that Madara is that guy. Itachi is that guy. Uh, the third Hokage is that nigga. Just so, in case y'all forgot, don't let Orochimaru fool you. The third Hokage. He was a he was a terrible parent, parental figure. He was a terrible figure to take care of anybody except for his family. You left you, what a child with the president. How you think that's gonna turn out? Oh, okay. How do you, how does nephew turn? I don't out? think I, I, I don't. Turn out? We take an orphan child to Joe Biden and said, "Hey, Joe, you are responsible for this child," and he runs the entire country. Joe is in a different country every week. You really think that nigga's worried about the orphan child? I don't. I don't Joe think Joe would you, remember the orphan Joe child. Got him a Joe name like he got like. Oh, and guess what? Just, 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 just in case y'all don't you know, you would look Joe at you and go, "Why does tomatoes smell like bacon?" Nope. Joe and Third Hokage are the same age. So imagine giving the baby <laughs> the same age I, Joe is now. I trust the anime character a lot. So more. I see we're going to clearly have to have an anime court episode on putting the Third Hokage on court. For what? For what? Being a he geriatric a bad dad. figure. He's Who's a bad a dad? Parent. You're the terrible dad. He's we're gonna end this one on this. this. Child. You know what? You know what? We'll save him for next time. We're gonna we'll save, save this for next time. time Cause we'll y'all clearly see time. how clearly we're gonna be heated about this bullshit. So no, Kage was a good parent. No four. Hush. We'll the get on y'all next time. The reason why the six was is 